What is going on guys? Bang Lee here coming back at you with another video today back at MLB The Show 18 Diamond Dynasty for another player debut and that is going to be Ozzy Albies, player of the month card, 86 overall second baseman. He's a switch hitter with great speed and great power against lefties. Hopefully we're lucky enough to face a lefty. He can still hit righties pretty well, 71-68 in terms of contact and power, but we want to face a lefty. 98-84 is insane. His fielding and arm strength, everything like that is going to be more than acceptable at second base. And then 86 speed is fantastic. He's going to be batting in the two hole. We also still have Didi Gregorius. I'm also trying out Aaron Judge. I have three at bats with him, or I guess three plate appearances and then a walk. And uh, haven't gotten a hit with him yet. Struck out once, apparently. And uh, this is the lineup we're running with. I know some people want me to use the best possible team, but that's not why I have all these cards. Uh, it's, you know, for the individual player debuts, I can try out different guys and things like that. And that's kind of what I'm all about. 37-8 and eight overall so far. Um, really want to face a lefty. But if not, I want someone uh, somewhere where his power is going to be great. And I think Yankee Stadium is going to be a perfect spot for that, uh, for that power if we have to face a righty. All right, the Boston, Boston Red Sox. So we're playing an absolute moron. Thinks that you need to uh, include your location twice. Also doesn't know that Red Sox is two words. This guy is a grade A. He's a grade A idiot. That's what it comes down to. We got Garrett Richards on the mound. This is my first time facing him. He's got Shohei Otani. Lou Brock, Didi, JD Martinez, Gary Sanchez, Wade Boggs, Brian Dozier, George Springer, Cody Bellinger. It's a pretty good team. All right, here is Ozzy Albies. Was on top of that curveball. It was a weird spot. I just didn't adapt to it well. And uh, Shohei can get pretty filthy on the mound. But we're going to swing first pitch and beat the shift. Because there was not. I don't know why I said that. We had a shift last time. I don't think there was a shift that time. I think Dozier was just out there. Albies with a single starting it off nice in his debut. He's got some speed on the base path too. We'll see what he does. I might try to steal on the third pitch. He's going real slow and he's going to slide step. Yeah, there's Arenado. I'm just not hitting the ball well. First game of the day, first couple swings, and I'm just not on it as much as I'd like to be. It was dead on with Albies, but, you know, we need more than one guy to to uh, to get a hit if we want to score, for the most part. I know home runs exist. Oh, that's a rip. Lou Brock was late on the fastball, but it's going to pay off, and he's going to get a hit. And now we have 99 speed on the base path. That's almost a guaranteed steal. And a run will get across. We force the ground ball. Didi's there throughout J.D. Martinez. He's going to take an early 1-0 lead, though. So we're going to be playing from behind pretty early here. All right, this is going to be my first at bat with Aaron Judge, probably since the game came out. I may have used him in BR like day one. So we'll see how we play with him. His strike zone is obviously pretty big because of how tall he is. But he's got some serious power. Lace that one foul. We're going to swing 3-0 with El Gary. That's going to get out of here. Crushed it. Can't be afraid to swing 3-0 when you know you're going to get a pitch right down the middle. He left one over, and we destroyed it with El Gary. And then back-to-back, to back, Cody Bellinger. No doubt over the advertisements for uh, the game we're already playing. 409 feet. Just missed that one by a lot, actually. I'm going to power swing again. Oh, laced with Garrett Richards. He just doesn't have the power. I'm telling you, that first pitcher home run is going to come eventually. It might not be today. It might not be this video. But I will get a pitcher home run. And no Shohei Otani, Babe Ruth BS. Like an actual pitcher who can't hit for anything. Maybe, well, I, Mad Bum counts. Jake Arrieta counts. Those are the only, like, two pitchers I know that hit home runs sometimes. I know Mad Bum especially. I think Jake Arietta's hit a couple, though. Good range from Ozzy Albies there. Puts it away for out number two. Good two-seamer. Albies is going to be there. The man of the episode putting it away for out number three. Look at the defensive ability. Oh, my goodness. Get that man a gold glove. And he just struck me out again. What is going on? I just didn't push up all the way. Jesus. 
smash it with Didi. That's so odd. I, I think I was talking about on stream last night, twitch.tv slash bengal if you guys are not following me already on Twitch. But I think I have a swinging strikeout, like one out of every 150 at bats or something like that. Um, as Didi crushes that one. Carry, carry, get out. It's gone. Didi Gregorius home run. That is what I was saying. Uh, one out of every 150 at bats or so, I feel like uh, I am striking out swinging. I mean, I'll strike out looking more often than that. But then back to back to start this hitting, I'm going to strike out swinging. Just very odd. Usually I'm on the ball pretty well. Could be because it's the first game, but I started to see the ball pretty well in the second inning. So it's just going to be about getting that rhythm, getting that eye back, and uh, finishing this guy. Didi's going to ground out to Cody Bellinger, out number three. No runs allowed, but Lou Brock, man, he's hurting me. Oh, Charlie Blackman annihilates the baseball. And we're hitting all our home runs right in the same spot. Right over that 364-foot fence marker. And then there's El Gary. He's going to beat the shift with a laser beam in the left field. Oh, Cody. Get out. Get out. Bellinger, please. We're sending him. It's gone again. That's why I have Cody Bellinger in the lineup, man. He's unbelievable. And he requested a friendly quit. You're out of your mind. Yeah, he's gone. Um, should we play another? I think so. Albies, I mean, he got a base hit, but nothing special. And I might want to put Joey Gallo in the lineup. Because he's kind of a beast. Alright, I'm putting Cody Bellinger on the bench after a two-run game. A two-home run game. He's a beast. These are all online stats. He's hitting 385 with 28 home runs. And that's Battle Royale. That's events. That's ranked seasons. He's just a monster. Uh, and then... Joey Gallo, though, I used him in BR last night on stream. He's hitting 404, and 21 of his hits are, it should be 21 hits. 14 of them are extra base hits, including 13 home runs, 9 walks, including intentional walks as well. Um, he's just, a, he's an absolute monster. And I was talking to Healy, and Healy's like, if you're not using him, you're doing yourself a disservice. And I'm like, he is really good. Might as well throw him in there. And we'll see if we can force another rage quit and then get out of here a little bit early for this video. Shout out to you, Jay Conti. Appreciate you for watching the stuff, man. Unless you're lying, in which case I hate you. Yeah, I get a message after like every game I play. You're like, oh my god, I watch your videos. And I'm like, if everyone that ever messaged me and it will be the show watched my videos, I'd have way over 100,000 subscribers. <laughs> this is a really good team, though. He's got Player of the Month Didi as well. Nelson Cruz, Chris da uh, Crush Davis. I kind of combined this at Krish. I don't know, Indian? Holly Chris? I don't know. Gary Sanchez, Willie Sargel, Billy Williams, Jim Edmonds, Brett Saberhagen, then his, uh, his creative player, Sheik Huh. Batting ninth. Ooh, 79 gold. Am I 79 gold too? I feel like I am. Oh, wow. Struck me out looking. That's a sick curveball. Here's Albies, though, against the righty. We got the short porch in New York. Ah, uh, way out in front. And uh, that was a pretty disgusting pitch. Made very quick work of Curtis Granderson. And he's going to walk Albies. Let's see what he does with Didi. Oh my god. That was a hanger. Please get out of play. Wow. Right to him. Dude, I, it's centered up. I know I'm just early on that. Why is that hit straight up into the air, though, you know? What's up with that? That one hung badly, man. He just took four straight balls with Nelson Cruz to reach base, and then he crushed the home run with Crush Davis. And uh, it just hung up really bad on me. I wanted about that level, but it came right over the middle of the plate. Get El Gary out. That one's going to hang a bit. He's going to pop it up, though. Wouldn't be surprised if he centered that ball up. In theory, he would have pushed straight down there. And given where the ball is, he probably would have smashed that. He was late with weak contact, but I would not be surprised if he squared that thing up. As he squared that one up, you got to make a play, Granderson. I uh, I didn't time that well at all. <laughs> I'm pretty good at those usually. I didn't time that well at all. 
Here's a 2-2. I'm expecting a curveball low. It's not going to be a curveball. Sat back on it. Made pretty decent contact. Um, Would have been an out with or without a shift. But uh, unfortunately, we don't capitalize there despite squaring up the ball with good timing. Maybe El Gary can get me on the board here. That's hit pretty well. Not well enough, though. Early on a pitch on the outside corner of the plate. Fantastic pitch. He's pitching well. He's hitting well. And he's got a 3-0 lead. Shika. That's what this guy's name definitely is. But uh, we're going to have good range there, hopefully. Granderson. All right, out of the inning. Just got to keep pitching well. Uh, made a couple mistakes, and that led us to being down 3 nothing. But we've been pitching okay for the most part. Other than, of course, the 3 nothing deficit. Blackman. Going to get a little bit underneath that one. Hit it pretty well, not well enough. Didn't pull it hard enough. Otherwise, that's, you know, so gone to right field. I can't tell you guys how badly I want to pitch her home run. Arietta's got some pop off the bat. It's not insane or anything. I power swung on that. I I just missed. What is his power? 32 versus righties. Hey, 32 could get one out of here. <laughs> I don't know in what world, but it's possible. I think I'm just going to go to a regular swing. Yeah, <laughs> that one's not going to get over the head of DD. Oh, it is. Holy shit. Arietta reaches. I made really good contact on that. I'm glad I got a hit. Oh, well, obviously, but I mean, like, ah, I don't know. I guess I didn't hit it that well. Granderson, please. That's smoked into center field, and it's going to be out number two. Yeah, right on it just early. Oh, I didn't expect the hanging curveball. I was not ready at all. That's a, that's a great pitch. Oh, and he hit Albies. Who reaches base again here. We got saved in a in an 0-2 count there. And here's Didi. He's been pitching pretty weirdly. A lot of off speed, of course. But uh, in, in odd spots, though. But I don't know, here, here's a 3-1. He's going to pitch to Didi. No way. Foul tipped that one with that PCI. With no shift with runners on base is when Didi's at his deadliest. And I missed it. Underneath it. Fly out to center field. Once again, we don't capitalize. It's a good changeup. Yeah. I've been using that changeup more. And it is a really, really effective pitch depending on where you locate. I just got to get some runs on the board, man. We've had opportunities. Just haven't been able to capitalize yet. There's one. Nolan Arenado. Crushed. On the board. 3-1. Only down by two if you guys are students of mathematics. Yeah, right on that. Change up Hong. Smashed it. Let's go back to back with Judge. Oh my god. I missed that one. It's not even PCI screwing up. I just missed. I just I was waiting for that to drop down a little bit more. And it just didn't. Yeah, you can see. I mean, just missed it. I expected that to be a bit lower. Gallo, please. Ah, underneath. Oh, laid out with Gallo. Couldn't make the play. That's Judge in right field. What am I talking about? Dude, I don't know. Like, I am so boggled. <laughs> I think I'm playing players at different positions because I wanted to before the game and then I see him and it's like you know judge is a big fella Joey Gallo is a big fella and I don't know why I thought Joey Gallo was in right field I have no idea surprised I didn't even say Bellinger he's not even in the starting lineup but it's what I specialize in tough at bats with my pitcher you can't just pitch to him I will put good contact on the uh, on the ball hmm He's going to run me back to the base. He's going to put on the slap tag. I uh, I thought he'd just go straight to first. That was bad base running on my part. And uh, we're that, like, that, that was just bad. That was bad on my part. Awful. Granderson, please stay fair. It's going to be foul. It's the Bengals special. Oh, we caught that. Wow. That's okay. 
Not even the Bengals special. That stayed in the park. Early contact or okay contact. And I'm not like I'm not gonna swing at that. It's a, yeah, it's a meatball. I don't know. And then Albies is maybe gonna ground out. Absolutely gonna ground out. Saber Hagen's got wheels apparently. Wow, he crushed that. A change up away. S absolutely smashes it. Now we're down 4-1. Back to a three-run deficit. Arenado. Carry. It's going to be a long fly out. <laughs> uh, judge. Please. Really? What is the wind here? Man. Oh, back eight miles per hour. <laughs> Jesus. Oh my. Oh my god! What, is, what are you doing? Get him at two. Thank you. Safe! What? Jesus. Let's look at the replay here. Ground ball. Arietta. I'm like, he's gonna get this. Spins around. I don't know. Fucking ballerina. And then... I thought that Arenado was going to go to the ball, so I got... I thought I was controlling him, but really, it had me on Didi Gregorius. And then, you know, Didi gets the ball, throws in a second, beats the runner, and Albies doesn't ap apply the tag fast enough. For someone like me that lives and dies by the long ball, the wind being what it is is not helping. Because I'm centering up the ball. Or, mm, I've centered up the ball this game a little bit. And I haven't been rewarded. Some of them I'm just missing on. It's just unlucky. 3-0 to Gallo. I need base runners. It's top of the 7th. I can't screw around anymore. I Well, it's not like I'm playing around or anything like that. But I, I mean, I, I need runs. I need base runners. He only has two more hits than we have. He's just... He's capitalized on his opportunities more than we have. He's going to bring in Lee Smith. So, so cutter, hard fastball, fork ball. And he's got a slider as well. Great fork ball. That was hard to lay off. That's a that's a sick cutter. That's a sick pitch. I capitalize uh, on failing again. This doesn't make any sense what I just said. We do get to finally face a lefty though. Come on, Albies. Albies has that power and that contact against lefties. It's a sick pitch. Come on, man. Albies crushes it! Let's go, man. Second deck. Almost. Ozzy Albies in his debut. So he's bringing in Mookie Betts. That was his change. And he's going to pitch to Griffey Jr. Oh, he hung it. I just, I wasn't, ah. Uh, I, I freaked out. Only two runs, man. That's not a good start. Didi makes it look easy out there. At shortstop with the shift. Here's Gallo, though. I feel like I just missed that one with Griffey. And I'm on top of it. Gallo. Down to our final out. Damn. I really thought that was going to drop more. Or, uh, yeah, stay up, I mean. Didn't mean drop. I just missed it, too. That's what this inning has been. Just missing the ball. And I'm going to miss it with Gary Sanchez. This time underneath and to the left of it. And we're going to drop this second game here. I got outplayed. Plain and simple. The win did me really no favors. So when I finally was on the ball, it didn't go anywhere. Which sucks. Albie's got a homer at least. Love to see that. But thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And I will see you in the next one. Take it easy.